Bienvenidos and welcome to another episode of Spain on a Fork. So with Christmas being just a few days away, today I'm going to show you how to make a dish that's perfect for the holidays. It has such a gorgeous presentation, yet it's easy enough to enjoy all year round. We're talking bacalao a la miel. This dish is basically cod fillets that you fry in extra virgin olive oil until they're golden fried. And then you finish them off in a sauce that's made with honey, raisins, and pine nuts that gives this dish the most incredible sweet and savory flavor. Folks, we're talking a ton of goodness, just a handful of ingredients, and the best part, it's all done in under 30 minutes. All right, let's just dive right into this recipe. I'm gonna heat a large fry pan with a medium heat and add in a quarter cup of extra virgin olive oil, which is 60 milliliters. While the oil is heating, I'm gonna add in two cod fillets over some paper towels and pat them completely dry. The size of the fillets I'm using are eight ounces, which is 225 grams each. And as always, I'm using cod that are about frozen and thawed out, but you can also use the fresh stuff here, as well as any other type of firm white fish. Then we'll season the cod with sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper. And then we'll coat each filet in some all-purpose flour, making sure they're evenly coated all around. Okay, let's move back to the fry pan. Once the olive oil is nice and hot, but as you can see, it's not smoking, so it hasn't lost any of its beautiful flavor, we'll add in the cod fillets into the pan. And we're just gonna go for two minutes per side here until the cod fillets are lightly golden fried. At this stage, you don't have to fully cook them through. After four minutes, and the cod fillets are lightly golden fried, once again, you don't have to fully cook them through at this stage, we'll remove them from the pan and set them aside. Now using the same pan with the same heat, I'm gonna add in one small onion that I finely chopped and three cloves of garlic that I roughly chopped. And as always, we'll mix the ingredients around continuously, that way they don't brown too quickly, and they all evenly saute. After three to four minutes, and the onion is nice and translucent, and that garlic is beautifully fragrant, I'm gonna add in a quarter cup of raisins, which is 50 grams, two tablespoons of pine nuts, which is 18 grams, two tablespoons of honey, which is 42 grams, and I did add a little olive oil into the measuring spoon as this ensures that the honey doesn't stick to it, and one teaspoon of sweet smoked Spanish paprika, which is two and a half grams. Then we'll season with sea salt and freshly cracked black pepper, And we'll continue to mix this continuously and saute the ingredients for about one minute. As always, the Spanish paprika I'm using is from Kiva. Link where you can get some in the description box below. And if you buy it from that link, you'll also get 25% off your order. After about one minute, I'm gonna add in one cup of vegetable broth, which is 240 milliliters. You can use other liquids here, such as chicken broth or even fish broth. Either way, link on how to make my homemade veggie broth in the description box below and we'll give it a gentle mix, and then simmer it between five to 10 minutes. This is enough time for all the flavors to develop and for that sauce to slightly reduce. After five to 10 minutes, and the sauce has slightly reduced, we'll add in the cod fillets back into the pan. And we're gonna simmer this for another three to four minutes or until the cod is fully cooked through. And make sure again they're at the halfway point and gently flip the fillets, that way they can fully absorb all that goodness. After four to five minutes and the cod is perfectly cooked through, this dish is ready to go. I'm gonna remove the pan from the heat, transfer one of the fillets of cod into a serving dish, and top it off with some of the sauce. And for the final touch, we'll sprinkle it with some chopped fresh parsley. Check it out, bacalao a la miel, Spanish cod with honey. Beautiful presentation, filled with so many great flavors, and the best part, all done in under 30 minutes. Let's give it a try and see how it turned out. One 
once again folks bacalao a la miel this i am so excited to try it looks absolutely beautiful here we go grabbing a little bit more of that sauce it truly is mind-blowing delicious but first things first is that fish by finish uh, cooking it in the sauce it has this beautiful melt your mouth texture and as for the flavors the raisins the honey, the pine nuts, and that sweet smoked Spanish paprika, an explosion of sweet and savory goodness. You saw this, very easy to make, done in under 30 minutes, serve it next to some roasted potatoes, and of course a bottle of Spanish wine, but more specifically from the region of Jumilla, you're gonna have yourself an amazing meal, either right now during the holidays or any time of the year. Really quick before I go, a shout out to a couple of my patrons, Marco Steenbergen, Holly Parker, Rogelio Jr. Rivera, and Elaine Engros. Again, guys, thank you so much for being patrons of Spain on a Fork. You know how much I appreciate you. If you enjoyed today's video, hit that like button as it really helps out the channel. Leave me a comment below. And as always, don't forget to share this video with your family and friends. That way our Spain on a Fork community can continue to grow. Till the next time, hasta luego.